Hey guys, Rick and Pierce Curran of TV Scaly Adventures, and we're here today with an innovative new product from our friends at Midwest Tongs, Dana Savarelli. And uh, so you've got something really cool there. Pierce, tell us about it. Yes, this is not just a random piece of piping we found, but actually, it's a really cool device right here. So, this is very cool. This is the snake trap from Midwest Tongs. And what it is, is it's these two little safety cone looking things right here. Now, you clip them onto the sides of a PVC pipe, and then a reptile like a snake or lizard or other small critter will crawl inside thinking it's a very comfortable place to spend the night or just to hide in. And once they get inside, it will fall down in, and as you can see, it cones in the middle. So they will plop down into the bottom of the PVC, which would imagine would be right about here. And anyone who owns snakes knows that they love to probe corners instead of like the middle. So they will try to push the corners of the PVC instead of trying to go right back out the hole. So it's a really cool thing if you have a professional snake room and you're concerned about an animal getting loose. Yeah. What are you talking about? You could put some, you could put this down on, in the corner somewhere. The snake will tend to follow up along the wall and it can get inside of here and then you just frequently check it. The part you supply is the PVC pipe. And the cool thing about it is this is a thin walled PVC pipe, four inches in diameter. So you can actually make it smaller or longer if you want, depending on the size of the animal that got loose. Now, the cool thing about this is when you order this from tongs.com, you're gonna to be able to get these graduated cones. You can cut them to the size of the animal that you wanna catch. Now, the cool thing for me is I don't have a snake room that I really worry about because we don't have venomous snakes in our house or anything like that. But what we do like to do is go out on different type of reptile hunting adventures so that we can catch different things, photograph them, show them in the show. And this is a great opportunity for Pierce, me, and even Tiny to go out, set one of these out, and check it every few hours to at the end of a day and and just see what we catch in there. Now, put it together, Pierce, real quick. This is how innovatively cool this is. It takes just a couple seconds to put it together. You snap the two ends of it on, and then what you're gonna notice is that there are holes placed here. I suggest you go and get yourself a couple of bungee cords, and that way it will pull it tight, because when any animal gets inside of here, it's gonna push it, and it is possible it could push the ends off. So you do wanna secure the ends. But the other responsible thing is do check your traps often, because it's inhumane to keep an animal inside of something without any water. Another cool idea is if you have an animal that you know is in a room and you can't quite capture it, you can put a piece of prey item in here, like a rat or something like that, and that'll help entice the animal in. So be sure to check out our friends at tongs.com. Check out their new snake trap. And if you're someone who likes reptiles, collects reptiles, or occasionally has one get loose. I don't know why he keeps looking at me. <laughs> you want to check out the snake trap at tongs.com. We'll see you over at tongs.com.